Hey everyone, it's Blake Bundy here from Winning Solutions Inc. And today I will be bringing you guys another Microsoft Access Expert Template Walkthrough. I will be showing you guys where to find the template database on our website, how to download the template database demo, and how to use the demo properly. Most of our templates are not designed to be used on their own. Instead, they are designed in a way that makes it simple and smooth to integrate it into an already existing database that you have already been using. You can also build a more robust Microsoft Access database that is built around one of our templates. If you would like to create a new database that is based off of one of our templates and don't know how or do not have the time to do so, let us know and we would be happy helping you with getting the database that 100% fits your needs. With most of our templates that we offer, there's three different versions that you can purchase. A compiled runtime version, one for internal use, and one for unlimited developer use. Our, our compiled runtime version is a run as is version without the paid full version of Microsoft Access using the free Access runtime from Microsoft. It can be integrated into your existing Access application, but you would not be able to make any modifications to the forms, the reports, the modules, etc. This option is more for those of you who do not see any need to make any customizations to the template. Our internal use version allows you to use or modify the databases however you wish within your organization. And last but not least, our unlimited developer use version allows you to use the database template however you wish for any applications you develop and distribute the template as part of a database you create. Winning Solutions Inc's templates have a strong advantage over shrink wrap software that you purchase from a store or website. With our templates, you receive the source code along with your purchase so you are able to customize and update the database as you please. With shrink wrap software, you do not receive the source code when purchasing the software, which means that you cannot update or customize the database as you wish. In our video today, we will be working on a demo version of our database template. A demo is a simple way that you can view and try out our database templates so that you can determine if you would like to purchase it or not. This is great for customers due to the fact that all of our sales are final. Our sales are final because when we, we give you the source code when you purchase the template. And once we give you the source code, there is really no way that you can return the code. If you'd like to test out our demos for multiple days, you are free to do so. All you have to do is leave the database open so that the data you enter will not be wiped. That is because our demos are designed so that once you close the demo, all the data that you have entered will be wiped from that database. You have to purchase the full version if you would like to save your data that you have entered. Upon downloading a demo for one of our templates, you will have to unzip the downloadable file. Zip files make it much easier to send and download large files over the web. Unzipping a file is a very simple step. All you have to do is extract the file so that you have access to the uncompressed file. If you do not know how or do not understand how to unzip a file, check out our YouTube channel and watch the How to Unzip One of Our Files video tutorial to learn this simple step. The link to that video will be in the description of this video. So now, let us get into downloading and testing out one of our templates. We're going to start off here by going to our website at microsoftaccessexpert.com. As you can see, I have been here before. On the top of our website, there's going to be a toolbar with all the various ways that you are able to contact Winning Solutions, Inc. You're going to want to click on the sidebar button on the left side of our homepage that is labeled Database Templates for Sale. A sublist then opens up and you need to select the Database Templates List button to view the list of all of our templates that we offer. The list is broken up into categories. The different categories that we currently have are our most popular ones, appointment and scheduling databases, calendars databases, reservations and booking databases, contact and communications databases, task management databases, equipment and maintenance tracking databases, sales databases, employee databases, education databases, small business databases, and last but not least, database tools and miscellaneous templates. And today we're gonna to be taking a look at our Microsoft Access Time Hour Tracking Database Template. 
So go up just a little bit here and under our small business section, select the access time hour tracking database. And then once you open that page, scroll down just a little ways here and in our download a demo section, download the demonstration that correctly corresponds with the version of Microsoft Access that you are currently running on. So I'm gonna go ahead and download this one. Once I've downloaded, I'm going to open the file and this file is zipped so you need to extract all of the file hit extract all then hit extract and then once you've extracted the file you need to open the file and so with all of our database templates since they do come from the web your computer views it as a potential security risk or warning now I can assure you that this database template is safe so I'm gonna go ahead and continue on and open the file and so this is the time hour tracking database so it's perfect for keeping track of time and the amount of hours spent on specific projects or companies. However, if you like this database template, but maybe you want to customize a little bit, you want to implement it into an already existing database, or you just want to tweak a few things, contact Winning Solutions Inc. because we can customize the database template to meet any requirement that you do wish. Okay, so to get started here, we're going to input some time or hours, but as you can see, under our employees, there is already some test employees. So we're going to use a test one, that's just used for the sake of the demonstration, like I said you'd be able to put in your own information. And as you can see, you can put a start time and an end time. And you can even start a timer if you want. So it's gonna start it, so it's today, 8.07 a.m. And the end time is today, we're just gonna put, we'll just leave that blank, we'll just say today. And the total amount of minutes on it, obviously that's not calculated yet, but if you're calculating an already a project that's already done, you'd be able to put in your total time spent on it. And the company, these are just test information, like I said just for the sake of the demonstration but we are going to use company two project this is also another test information in here project company two miles we're going to say we didn't drive anywhere and you can even input more notes about it if you want about the customer or the project so now we're going to save and close so now what you can do is you can search for that time and hour too so if you want to search all time entries done by Jonathan Esterbrook or you can even do work date just search by work date or just start search for start time or company all that good stuff we're going to you can do that, but we're going to hit search. And so as you can see, this is the one that we had actually know. This is the one right here we had just created. So the total time hasn't been calculated yet since it hasn't been created yet. But as you can see, some previous information that was inputted in here for test purposes were right there. And that's how they are created. 242 total minutes spent on a project on September 13th. Okay, but this is our new one you can, we put in, and you can even double click if you want to edit some more information about it, as you can see, but we are not going to edit anything now, so we're going to close out of it, and close out of this. And so, you can also search for companies, so maybe you want to search by company 2, we're going to hit that search, or even specific project, but we're just going to do company 2 as a total, and there is that company that we created. So you can input new companies, maintain employees, so you can put new employees, all that good stuff if you purchase the database template pretty detailed database template and this is where you can add new companies and all that good stuff you can even put a picture for the company maybe a company logo or something like that however we will not do that for the sake of the demonstration so I'm gonna go ahead and thank you guys for taking your time to watch this Microsoft Access Expert template walkthrough brought to you by Winning Solutions Inc. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to give us a like or subscribe to our YouTube channel for tons of other walkthroughs and tutorials. As always, feel free to contact us for any of your IT needs, whether it be programming that you need, you want to buy a template, you want to customize a template, anything. Feel free to contact Winning Solutions Inc. whenever you would like. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to post our contact information in the description below of this video. Also, you can find us on about any social media platform. Feel free to follow us or like us on any of those websites we post quite frequently. Once again, thank you guys for taking your time to watch this Microsoft Access Expert template walkthrough and have a great day.